Hello and what is going on today guys, Tomcat here, and in this video, we're gonna be driving something very odd, and strange, and it's, well, I found it on the Steam Workshop, and I, and, oh god, I didn't even notice, the text is backwards on the side. <laughs> I'm, you know what, I'm gonna leave the engine uncovered, and let's see, I am gonna add, like, the winch on the front and the lights and like a snorkel tube but that's about it so let's get this thing started up and see what uh what happens i guess um it's right off the bat it's not exactly what you would expect to see running around in the, like oh god it's not getting any traction at all low maybe low kind of works I'm using my, uh, my specific test course on the- OH GOD! Start! No! It- Whoa! It doesn't really work! <laughs> Come on! Oh god! It doesn't really work, but... It seems to be- Oh god, it seems to be making an effort to flip itself back over, it's possessed! Holy crap, come on! Oh, you stupid thing! It's sunken into the ground now. I was gonna attempt to run my, um, my test course at the hill with this thing. Which is normally not too hard. I mean, it's, it's, it's tricky, but it's definitely not the most difficult trail you could find in spin tires. However... This vehicle is definitely on the verge of being one of the most difficult uh, vehicles to control that I've ever driven in not just in spin tires, but in any game. This thing is a uh, Nightmare Absolute nightmare to drive. I can't oh dear. I it's it's sinking into the ground again and you, Oh my god, I can't <laughs> What what what? Oh god, this is becoming a test of, of like, survival now. Alright, come on. Let's see what this thing can do as far as, well, let's see what we can do with it. And let's see if we can keep it upright. Because it, the steering, by the way, is extremely quick and extremely snappy, almost too quick. You can't really control or predict where it's going to go. And it's so top-heavy that it will go over at a moment's notice. Immediately. Let's try this one more time. Shall we? Let's have crawler gear. It's gonna go over! It... Wow. Wow, wow, wow. It just goes... It... It will go end over end, it will go over the side, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. This thing is so... Well, it's just so bad. <laughs> it's that bad to drive. It really is just that bad to drive. I bet you it would roll over right here if I tried to make, like, if I tried to make it roll over right here. I wonder, if I drove up on that, like, barrel, would it roll over? No, because it glitches through the barrel. Lovely. Let's just try driving it down the road and making it a challenge to see how far we can go without flipping. Which I can, I can probably say is not going to be that far. No. Mm-mm. 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 Not going to be that far. Guaranteed. Guaranteed. 100%. What kind of first... No way. We've got a cockpit cam. Hell yes. No, seriously. That, I'm gonna get out of that camera view now, that's like, I, it's not going to work. When it comes to, like, no flex and the highest center of gravity possible, you get this right here. I mean, I may have found the worst driving vehicle in spin tires, I don't know, I may have found it. It's, although, well, I don't know, because it actually does decent in the mud, so I can't really say... It's the worst driving vehicle in the game. Now, considering the fact that it's actually on, like, a full mud setup right now, I mean, you would not take this thing rock crawling. If you took this thing rock crawling, you'd be making a horrible mistake. 
But mud? I could see how that would work. It's gonna go over, like, right there. It, the, the center of gravity is so horrible. You can't barely... You oh, I'm Like, it's literally taking... I'm going back and forth on the controller right now, trying to control the steering. It's ridiculous. All right, let's see how it does through the river. The river is gonna be... Well, it's gonna be dramatic. Let's just say that right up the... Oh, dear. Oh, God. Come on. Let's go. Not too bad. No, not too bad. I mean, when you think about it, when you think about it, <laughs> it's not the worst thing in the world, actually. It, it, it isn't. No. It's close, but it isn't. I mean, compared to what? Blowing up and then and then, oh god, it's it's had an issue, but no, I mean when you compare it to what, exploding and then falling into a pit of lava, which then turns into solid rock and then you stay there for eternity. It's better than that, but other than that, it doesn't really have much going for it. It it's it really doesn't. Kind of running my uh, testing course backwards, which. It's kind of working. I mean, this seems like... You know what this vehicle seems like? It seems like a Top Gear challenge gone wrong. And you put it in high, and it's the wheels spin so fast that you get no traction anywhere. Another river crossing. Come on! It's so high that it doesn't even matter. It just goes. That, I will say, is a plus. But it's among the very few pluses of this vehicle. Come on, pull yourself up the other side. Yes, I know you can do it. Actually, I don't know you can do it. I'm taking a huge gamble on this by saying that. Well, you stupid idiot mobile. Come on. Telephone pole. It's horrid. It's absolutely horrid. It. How about low two? Aha! It made... A couple of inches of progress. Oh, there we go. Yes. Now we're, well, doing something. Not doing much, but doing something. And at least it does have harnesses, so it would pass safety inspection. Not really. Oh, move along. Good grief. Get out. Finally. What an utter piece of... I have, like, I, I, I know for a fact that I have younger viewers on this channel. There are things that I want to say about this vehicle. <laughs> there are many things that I would really like to say about this vehicle. But, um... Yes. But I like to keep these videos suitable for a wide audience, so I'm not going to say them at the moment. But I'm sure my older viewers know exactly, or at least can guess, where I was going with that last sentence. Let's see how far we can go in crawler gear of low two. It's picking up! It has no flex! It has absolutely- This has less flex than Jeep Guy's Jeep before it, like, before it, it actually, like, before we did it, it, the flex mods to it. Seriously. Has very little grip. It 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 just that is turned over again, and it's glitched out, and it's never ever. Oh! oh god. Oh, I don't know if he's like trying to make that some kind of recovery system, or oh well, we'll have to use it again, or not use it again. No, <laughs> no, it's died. It's dead. It's completely dead. I I think we may have to call that episode finished, honestly. I don't really like to finish episodes that quickly, but I, I feel like that might have to be it for this one. So, if you guys did enjoy this episode, then don't forget to click that like button. Tell me in the comment section down below what you guys thought of it. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button for more daily videos like this one in your inbox every single day. And I will see you guys in the next one. Talk to you guys later, and I hope you guys enjoyed.